there is a gravitational field around earth if any object comes inside the gravitational field what happens a force acts on that object similarly there is electric field around every charge and if another charge comes into that electric field a force will act on that charge suppose here is charge plus capital q there is electric field around this charge in this electric field you keep another charge plus small q so this charge plus q is kept in the electric field of capital q what will happen a force will act on this charge the same charge if you keep it here will the same force act no because according to coulomb's law force is inversely proportional to distance square so as the distance increases the force will decrease means the strength of the electric field is different at different points that strength of the electric field is called electric intensity so electric intensity is a vector quantity yes it is a vector quantity because electric field has got direction so electric intensity is a vector quantity which measures the strength of the electric field but this is not the definition of electric intensity here is a charge q there is electric field around this charge suppose this is a point p in the electric field and you want to find out the electric intensity at this point means the strength of electric field at this point what you do keep a test charge q0 at that point you want to find out the intensity at point p keep a test charge q0 at that point what is a test charge test charge is a very small positive charge very small vanishingly small means nearly equal to zero not zero nearly equal to zero vanishingly small why we take very small charge because we are testing the strength of the electric field at this point whose electric field capital q for testing that electric field we keep a charge here if this charge is big it will have its own electric field and the electric field of this charge will interfere with the original electric field therefore we have to take a very small charge as this q0 is in the electric field therefore a force will act on it that force per unit test charge is called electric intensity at that point so electric intensity at any point in the electric field is defined as the force acting per unit a positive test charge force acting per unit a positive test charge kept at that point that is the definition of electric intensity and from this definition the si unit of electric intensity will be newton per coulomb force newton charge coulomb so si unit of electric intensity is newton per coulomb